But yeah, once again, I just want to test the audio, make sure it sounds okay. I think I'm getting the hang of it right now. I'm using that Tascam DR05X. I have the input set to 15. Look at this guy. Input set to 15. I have the low cut set to 40 hertz. I've got the mic set to mono direction. Uh, 24 bit. Uh, and yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll post the uh, settings in the description of the video if you want to check it out. But I think I found the recipe here. I've got my uh, mic tucked in my cheek pad. Uh, and I, the camera I'm using is an Insta360 ONE X2. And what I have is I have that on a, a necklace. And it's mounted to the necklace so it's like on my chest right now. So you get an interesting view of my knees and my arms. And uh, yeah, this is, I think it's, it's super easy. It's, I think it's better than the helmet ones. Uh, it's just like really easy to get on and off. And you, you can um, also put the Insta360 on a, on the invisible selfie stick. Yikes. I, uh, I'm going to have to stop it. But uh, oh, yeah. Tomorrow what I'm going to do is I'm going to film a video of my audio setup uh, and that includes you know where my mic is and how uh, my camera's mounted on my neck uh, and then you can let me know if you see if you have any recommendations for something better or easier uh, definitely let me know but uh, yeah this setup so far uh, is the best I could find I used to have a like a shoulder clip that would go on the shoulder of my backpack and that's where I would mount my camera but then the view would be like over my shoulder you know some people have their uh, GoPros mounted to the side of their helmet and then you get this like weird kind of side view which I don't know uh, and then a lot of people have it on top and a lot of people have it on their chin I think the chin is probably you know the best view accurate view but really uh, the only downside with this being on my neck is um, when I turn I mean you're not gonna see my head turning obviously my chest is facing forward unless I really like turn my chest when I'm moving which I don't normally do but um, yeah this setup I'll, I'll, I'll post a video soon uh, showing how it works uh, but yeah the only thing I think I might also do is with um, the microphone in the cheek pad I, I might buy a dead cat and then place it uh, in front of uh, my mic right now so it has like even more wind buffering uh, watch this guy turn left just go brah go 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 uh, oh my word but yeah because once I start rocking and rolling and getting like over 40 miles per hour I think uh, that's when you start to hear the wind like buffeting and it, it distorts the audio a little but right now I'm only going 20 and it's thing sounds I think it sounds good 